just want to ask you about things coming together. Obviously, you had the exhibition to get a better sense of things, but just where things stand five days before you start the season. Well, we're still a work in progress. Um, it's a it's a good team. It's a fun team to coach. It's a team that uh, has built chemistry. It, it has a better understanding of how hard it needs to play. Uh, but we're still working out some kinks here and there. But uh, we're, we're certainly excited about our first game. Feel better about things after after the UT exhibition? Yeah, I do. I, I think uh, you know the guys carried over what we've been working on in practice. Uh, they executed well during the game. Uh, I thought the intensity and the effort was there. I didn't like our free throw shooting, but uh, definitely anything that we need to fix, we, we're, we're small and minor details that we can we can fix. You had zero turnovers from the point guards. How much is that to see? I was elated. <laughs> I, sometimes you look at stats and you're, you're saying how many points you score, how many this. That's the first thing I look for in, 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 for our point guards is the turnovers. And both guys did a phenomenal job of taking care of the ball, getting the ball to the right guys. So it was a major step in the right direction from our point guard position. Well, I know last year there was a couple of some issues with that. Anything you saw change that helped them? Well, I, I think we're keeping the game a little bit simpler for the guys. Um, we're, we're running more things, so guys know exactly where they're supposed to be, where the ball should be going. Uh, and I think that's helped quite a bit. And I think guys aren't forcing and trying to experiment as much as maybe they did in the past. Stan, everybody talks about this facility helping you more functionally, like free throw shooting, shooting, all those things. But what can having a home base like this do from a chemistry standpoint? We have a home. Um, <laughs> we, we have a place that uh, you know guys can congregate to. They can come at different hours of the day. Uh, there's lounge areas, locker rooms where you're just comfortable. If you're just taking a nap or just laying around or just watching TV, and, and so it brings the guys together a lot more. And, and we're, we're totally in this environment uh, pretty much exclusively. Where in the past, maybe we'd be practicing shooting around, people would be walking through the building right. uh, in the Sun Dome. We have the luxury of a little bit more private, intimate setting for right. just our men's basketball team. Do, do you see that just in terms of the closeness of this team? I mean, it, it, it's something where you would think just the, just the sheer time they spend together has to be good for the team because of that. Yeah, I, I think it's been gradual steps over the course of the past half year. From summer, uh, getting up early in the morning, boot camp experience that we did, um, opening this building, being excited about this, uh, obviously excited about the start of the season and how the lessons were learned from last year of when we don't have chemistry, when we're not working together and building that synergy, what could happen? Nobody wants to go backwards and I think that's a big part of it as well.